Any moment now, and there it is. Time to clock out on my shift, finally. All right, I'm headed home now, guys. See you later. Whoa, what a beautiful day outside. Look at that sky. Wait, why is it green? Oh, man, I'm exhausted. I can't wait to just get home, climb into bed, and watch a TV show or something. Wait, what is that? It's so small, I can barely make it out. What? what? Where'd it go? I don't see it anymore. It was, it was just there. Phineas, I'll take one triple ultra monster Krabby Patty. Hold the lettuce. Extra salt. <sighs> SpongeBob, one over complicated Krabby Patty. Oh, and drop it on the floor a couple times for me, okay? Thanks. <sighs> That'll teach him for being rude. So, Phineas, what's it like working at the Krusty Krab? When are you gonna add enchiladas to the menu, Phineas? You don't have to stare at me this entire time. Your meal Phineas. will be out soon. Actually, you know what? I thought I heard SpongeBob call me in the kitchen, so I'll just be in there and ignoring you. Ah, SpongeBob, we got another one of those maniac customers that... Wait. Patty's just laying out. Cheese? T tomatoes? What? He'd never leave these things just laying around like this. Is that Marvel Jack? How disgusting. Mr. Krabs always buys the cheap stuff. Ah, how dare he? SpongeBob must be ashamed, so he's hiding from me. Where you at, SpongeBob? Meanwhile. Ah, where are you taking me? Uh -huh. Welcome to my lab. <clears throat> I'll extract that brain one way or another. Brain? Now, Karen, where is a sponge brain? What do I gotta look? Okay, w what is this diagram? What are you drawing? A house? A square house? Okay, are those wheels? Uh, uh, oh, oh, you're, you're drawing SpongeBob. Uh, okay, it looks very nice. Now, where's his brain? No, no, it can't be that simple. R right in, in his head. In the middle of his head. No, he's a sponge. Oh, fine. Urgh. We'll figure this out, boy. Ah, what are you doing? I can't move. Oh, yeah, I injected you with a sleep serum. <laughs> Time to learn about sponge anatomy. Just grab my snip snips right here. Karen, yeah, yeah, what down. are you doing? What are you looking at? Come come on. Let's get serious here. Uh, oh, now you're just going to set the desktop wallpaper to the most embarrassing photo of myself. All right. I'm going to make a scientific estimate and say your brain is in your left arm. <laughs> You're a lefty after all, aren't you? Oh. <laughs> now brain. Good morning, Krusty Crew. Oh, hey, Patrick. Where's that idiot friend of yours? Which one? Uh, are you one of them? No, but this one idiot keeps stalking me. Get away from me. What do you want? Stop stalking me. Anyways, I reckon you're talking about a certain sea sponge. Yeah, him, SpongeBob. Oh, I thought you were talking about Fred the Clownfish. Yeah, I stuck a pipe bomb in his mailbox last week. You won't be seeing him again. SpongeBob? Well, lately he's been doing this thing where he starts blending in some cheese so I can't find him. Hey, SpongeBob, I'm here. Oh, shoot, Patrick's coming. Uh, how can I prank him real quick? Oh, good thing I got this 10 pound block of cheese just randomly sitting here. SpongeBob, are you home? Where are you? SpongeBob, I looked all over your house already and I can't find you. Ugh. Oh. Where is that guy? Oh, dang it. So, if you can't find him, he's probably blending into some cheese again. Oh, very funny. You think you can pull a fast one on me? Well, Patrick told me about your little tricks of blending in with the cheese. Hey, SpongeBob, I got a giant knife. So if you don't move, you're gonna get sliced into some Swiss cheese for real. Ha <laughs> ha, so if you're there, you better move. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, wait, is he done? <laughs> oh, I can't believe I touched that. Disgusting. Was he there? <sighs> he wasn't there. Darn it. Well, I'm out of ideas. If he's not there, then I don't know where he could be. That's the thing. He loves working at the Krusty Krab. So he would never miss a day of work no matter what. That's why I'm kind of hopeful that something happened to him. Maybe he got hit by a car or something. Wait, what? His arm grew back. This is the second time I've cut it off. Or how does he keep doing this? Ah, someone help me! Oh, give him the sleep injection. Karen, explain this. Sponges have a remarkable capacity to rapidly regenerate. Uh, what? This wasn't in the SpongeBob anatomy chart that I had. 
Well, all right. I guess my information's just out of date. I'll go make a serum that makes him stop regenerating limbs. No, oh, I feel the pain every time you cut it off. Ah! Ugh, third time doing this. There we go. Ugh, not that I'm complaining. Is it gonna grow back? It's not growing back. Finally. Huh. Well, now that that's taken care of. <laughs> Wait, you can put me on pain meds at least. Or just put me out of my misery. Make this over quick. Oh, I would make it quick. If Starbucks would stop giving me a grande drink, I'm a tiny plankton. And they give me grande? I don't know, Spanish? What's that, Karen? Is that Spanish for hammer? Okay, so I should randomly start hammering it? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe his brain's in that big nose of his. There we go. Oh, dang it. His brain isn't in his nose either. Oh, where's a sponge brain? Mm, I've looked everywhere in Horton. Let's make sure he isn't going brain dead on me, though. Because he's not responsive. SpongeBob is dying. What do I do? Karen, I'm going to replace you with this AI because you just haven't been helpful. Oh, it's typing something. One of the most popular theories is that SpongeBob died of a heart attack. <laughs> what? Since when? What are they talking about? Oh, here's an article. How SpongeBob died. Conclusion. This death of SpongeBob remains a mystery. Is this an actual discussion? You know what? I want his Nikes. I am taking those Nikes. I've never had shoes. I'm tired of walking around with my bare feet. Mur, Mr. Krabs must really pay terribly if these are his shoes. These are so uncomfortable. Oh, it feels like he's got a rock in him or something. Oh, get off of me. Why do I want these again? Wait, that wasn't his rock. That's his foot in there. I cut off his actual feet. <laughs> Gone so soon. <laughs> what are you doing? Looking at SpongeBob's Employee of the Month portrait again? Oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Listen, I know it's hard, but we could just get a replacement fry cook. I mean, I'm kind of glad he's gone. I don't want that idiot back in here going every two seconds and something happens. Oh, the mailman. If someone mailed a pipe bomb recently, it wasn't me. But do you think you could hand out these missing person flyers in every mailbox? Huh? Dude, there's nothing on there. It's just a block of cheese. Darn it, I knew I should have used that photo of SpongeBob at the Christmas party instead. Oh, well, it was worth the try. Yeah, well, I gotta get back to it, buddy. See ya. Why does it feel like I'm being watched? <sighs> Alright, I guess you're a righty after all. Uh, this must be what it feels like to be Lord Farquaad from Shrek. Ripping off Gingy's limbs. You know, this isn't as bad as it looks, SpongeBob. I'm sorry, but I've been living with one eye for this entire time. You you'll get used to it, okay? I gotta do this. The Krabby Patty secret formula is on the line. Alright, uh, welcome to the club of only having one eye, SpongeBob. Hey, Karen, look, I got contacts. Uh, oh, is that what I think it is? Uh, oh. It is! Finally! I can extract the Krabby Patty secret formula out of it! Alright, now on him, uh, I guess we just dump him out on the side of the streets? Oh wait, before I dump him on the streets, let me just shove it in crust in there. <laughs> Thanks for the brain, SpongeBob. I'll leave you out for the buzzards now. Mr. Squidward, Patrick is out there handing out flyers to look for SpongeBob. What are you gonna do? Oh, well, I would, but I gotta finish this third Arizona green tea before I do. I mean, if you look at the back of the can, it literally tells you the information on when it's best to look for a missing person. Hey, Squidward. I saw your boss's tweets on Clam Bark. Ha <laughs> ha. He's gonna dock your pay or fire you or something. Squilliam, fancy son. What? what? He posted that publicly? Well, why would he do that? What an idiot. So, I thought I'd just come in to rub it in. Okay, you know what? I'm tired of this. I'm gonna go look for SpongeBob. After one more. <sighs> Alright, let's retrace SpongeBob's steps. I can't imagine he'd be too far. Maybe he just forgot to come into work. Wait, what is that? What? Is that him? <laughs> SpongeBob? Please tell me this is just some homeless bum that looks like you. What the? <gasps> it is him! All his limbs are gone! What the? His eyes missing too? This is urgent. Oh, I gotta get him back. Mr. Krabs, look what I found! Ugh. 
Huh? You order Chinese, me boy? Ah, uh, not quite. Take a look. Uh, uh, it's SpongeBob. I found him on the side of the road. Holy mother of pearl! Uh, someone murdered SpongeBob, me boy, and all they could do is put him in a cheap Chinese takeout bag? What, are they just throwing money away? I would have done cheaper than that. Uh, he's still got duck sauce on him from that bag of Chinese. That's a waste of perfectly good sauce. Uh, and why the heck is there an Uncrustable in him? Uh. <laughs> Strawberry flavor. <coughs> Mr. Krabs. He's still alive. Oh, he can go back to making Krabby Patties. I mean, SpongeBob, me boy. Speak to me. What happened to you? Oh, oh we need emergency life-saving surgery. Emergency life-saving surgery? Wait a minute. But you don't offer us health insurance for working for you, Mr. Krabs. What kind of doctor is going to do that? Doctor? Pfft. He's not seeing a doctor. You're gonna do the surgery, Mr. Squidward! <sighs> Mr. Krabs, I was already a doctor before and I quit on the first day! Hey guys, did you call a doctor? S Squidward? Yeah, I'm surprised you know me. I was tired of being a cashier at the Krusty Krab, so I decided to become a doctor. Oh, this is the worst case I've ever seen! Oh, this is my first day on the job, too! This is so stressful! Nowhere in my human body book did it teach me about this! Does anyone know mouth-to-mouth -mouth CPR quick? Oh yeah, I got my buddy on that right now. Uh, I'm just as guilty as that alligator. I couldn't save the patient. I don't deserve to wear this hat. It went terribly. I don't know anything about reconstructing a sponge in surgery. What do you want me to do? Don't fret, matey. That's why I picked this up at Goodwill. Oh. <laughs> Oh. You're not really making our job any easier if you're trying to kill him. He's suffocating under there. Wait, what is this anyway? Is that me doing brain surgery? Oh, you use this, me boy, to practice operating on SpongeBob. And is that Patrick on there too? Oh, what? Oh, hey, Patrick's there too. I suppose I'll have to help you with the surgery also. Wait, is that... Plankton? Does that mean Plankton's the one who did this? Oh! Patrick doing surgery doesn't sound like a good idea Did to me. Did someone say life-saving surgery? Let me get this straight. You're telling me we're gonna operate on this SpongeBob on the board game when the real SpongeBob is bleeding out over here and he needs life-saving surgery? Well, you can't be operating on SpongeBob right away. You gotta get into practice first with this. Not to worry, guys. Ugh. Look what I got. I kidnapped Plankton's wife so we can use technology to hook up the board game to the actual SpongeBob. So everything we do on here applies to SpongeBob. You did what now? Kidnap Plankton's wife. Oh. Well then, boys, I'll leave you to it. SpongeBob's getting closer to Davy Jones' locker. So chop chop, get it done. I'm losing money the longer this goes on. Oh, don't worry, SpongeBob, we'll save you. Oh, am I doing this way? Wow, Patrick, you gotta remember, this thing's hooked up to him. He's feeling that pain. You're shocking him like crazy. Here, give me that. Oh, you're not doing it right. Ah, I'll show you how it's done. Eh. Oh yeah, you gotta get it right on there. You hear that noise? You hear that? Oh yeah, take that, SpongeBob! That's what's breaking in my house constantly! Whoa, what the- you're doing worse than me, Squidward! Alright, that was fun. I think I got all the revenge that I needed out of my system. Now, time to start actually taking this seriously. Uh, seeing that light go red and having SpongeBob screaming that he's getting shocked is gonna stress me out. Can we just cover it with his real nose so we don't know when we're shocking him? Uh, I don't think that's a good idea. Here, let me just take that off real quick. Uh, because then we're gonna get so used to making mistakes, we're not even gonna care. Why do we even start with this thing? Look at all the pieces. Shoehorn? Is that why every time SpongeBob's walking around, it's making that dumb squeaking noise? Elbow grease? Yeah, I guess SpongeBob's elbows are a little greasy. Heartburn? No wonder he's got heartburn. He's literally got a Krabby Patty inside of him. I'm sure anyone who eats Krabby Patties all the time is gonna suffer heartburn. Sorry Squidward, what did you say? I feel like my heart just skipped 20 beats in a row. How does this stuff even fit in his arms? SpongeBob's got arms the width of a noodle. Barnacle brain? SpongeBob has a brain? Well, at least they got it anatomically correct. Look how small his brain is. <laughs> also, what is this? Evil thoughts? SpongeBob's got evil thoughts in him? Quick, SpongeBob, what do you think of season six of your own show? <laughs> it was pretty good.
Oh no, the evil thoughts are stronger than I thought. That season had the two man incident and the splitter incident. Ow! Okay, it's on my foot. I'm okay. okay. No one could think it's good. In that case, Squidward, I'm getting the evil thoughts out first before he rubs my house or something crazy like that. What's it gonna steal? A TV man out of sand? <sighs> This is so stressful. I don't want to get SpongeBob electrocuted. Patrick, your arms are so shaky. I don't think you should be doing this. Not everyone's got the arms of a surgeon like you do, blue guy. Oh, sorry, SpongeBob. There was only a brief shock. Just go for it. Okay, I'm going for it. I hope this isn't contagious. I don't want to be getting evil thoughts too. Oh, I think I got it out. Look! Oh, 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 I feel so weird. Ugh. Did I just say season six was good? That season was garbage! Patrick, it worked. I think the evil thoughts are out of him. You're stepping on SpongeBob's nose. Ew, get that off of me. Hmm, so now what do I do? <gasps> Ooh, is that a burger launched inside SpongeBob's esophagus? I gotta get that out! A free burger? Oh, I hope it has extra mustard. Ah. Squidward, I got it out, look! Could you put that Krabby Patty anywhere else but the operating table? They're getting some dumb grease and ketchup all over it. <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm gonna have a heart attack? Like there's grease? Is that grease in my mouth? Oh no, what have I done? SpongeBob's dying, he's not breathing. Hey, hey, that's the most inappropriate bumper timing I've ever seen. <laughs> Making him crack up at his own death? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with the show writers, huh? We gotta get this tumor out, quick! Before it mutates or something, it turns into COVID-2. Oh, that was easy. Got it out. Look how hard some of these are to get it out. I mean, it's all the way in the corner. Squidward, I'm doing it. Look how much I'm getting out. Ugh, a whole chunk bone marrow. That's not the right one, Patrick. You're actually killing him. Who? <laughs> Enough of these baby toys. I'm using actual surgical equipment. <sighs> All right, let's see here. Just got to make a small precision on the eye. Enough wasting time. We got to save SpongeBob. <sighs> now I feel like a real surgeon. Look, I even gave SpongeBob his eye back. Oi, guys, how's it going in here? Time to put out a new employee wanted poster. Have you lost your mind? His state's getting even worse. By this point, he's gonna be dead by midnight. You know what? This is pretty fun. <laughs> what? Did you just cut off his other leg? <laughs> well, yeah, Squidward. This game is really fun. I don't want it to end. So let's give us something else to surgically add on. So the game can go on longer. No, 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 no. You, no, this is not happening. I'm not dealing with this. I'm taking that away from you. <laughs> Get away from my green tea. You're gonna get some blood in it. Oh, 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 SpongeBob! What have I done? There's gotta be something to save him. How about the computer? There's gotta be something to save SpongeBob's life on here. Like, like a button or something? Uh, where do I look? Uh, I can't find it. There's too many bonsai buddies. Why are there so many bonsai buddies? Oh, uh, I guess I'll be taking SpongeBob's body too away from you. I don't think that's a good idea either. Uh, there. Now don't touch him anymore. I mean, this is going so terribly. We're about to walk in the supermarket and instead of seeing canned tuna or canned bread, we're about to see some canned SpongeBob as food. Don't give Mr. Krabs any ideas. In case SpongeBob doesn't make it out of this one alive, we gotta have a backup plan so we're not like charged with murder or something. Meet the new SpongeBob. He's a square after all. Ooh, me no square. Me trapezoid. Hurt. Uh, what's he doing? Uh, Squidward, can I get some of that life-saving surgery, please? Nope, but you make a good doormat. <laughs> we gotta get SpongeBob's kidneys back. ASAP. Did you say kidneys? Ugh. Don't worry, SpongeBob. We'll get them back in you. I don't know what's worse, being in excruciating pain from having all my limbs and my eye ripped out, or having the taste of kidney beans in my mouth. Squidward, can I have a drink of that green tea to get this taste out of my mouth? You ain't touching my green tea. Patrick, these are kidney beans. They're not actual kidneys. These aren't helping him at all. He's probably suffocating. Oh no, these kidneys are good. 
All right, let me get the mouth in. SpongeBob, I'll save you. I'm coming for you. Ugh, I think it's out now. Huh, Patrick, do you notice something? Oh, wait, is that, is that a bean glowing? Hmm, uh, I don't really know. Oh, uh, I think I see it. Uh, I can't tell, though. It's covered in beans. What could that be? I don't know. It, it just feels like we're forgetting something. But I don't know what. Ah! Oh, wait, that's the buzzer glowing. Did, did you really just leave that in there? Uh, oh, no. I didn't know where else to put it. Uh, let me get it over there. Uh, I can't believe I just did that to SpongeBob. Uh, this surgery is botched, Patrick. I don't know what else we can do. I guess as surgeons, though, we should know SpongeBob's blood type in case he needs a blood transfusion. Uh, let's see here. What's this blood type? It should say it. Wait a minute. SpongeBob doesn't have a license? Eh, it's probably a forged license so SpongeBob can buy pineapple juice illegally on the market. I better cut it up. He can't be doing that. That really was my license. <laughs> it took me forever to get it, but I finally passed the test. I got lucky. And now it's destroyed. I gotta do it all over again. Oh. Oh, uh, Patrick did it. It's okay, Squidward. That license didn't have his blood type on it anyway. What really has his blood type on it is his milkshake license. Whoa, SpongeBob's looking weird in that photo. That's just a sticker. It's not a real photo. It's Plankton. Found that in SpongeBob's wallet. I guess when Plankton was busy mutilating SpongeBob, he just wanted some ice cream. He probably stole his bank account information, too, while he was at it. Anyways, Patrick, he's bleeding now. We should probably get back to work. I mean, we've been doing a terrible job. Uh... Oh. Oh, how are you feeling, SpongeBob? Okay, in that case, we're gonna continue. Oh no, he's back to rub it in. Ha! Squidward, Squidward, Squidward. I was wrong about you. Uh, a surgeon? I had no idea. That that's a high-paying job. <laughs> You're actually a respectable member of society. I studied this sponge diagram back in college. Complicated stuff. It's not easy. <laughs> yeah, we're killing the patient. Oh, sh shut up, shut up. Uh, he didn't mean that. Uh, uh, live surgery right now? Oh, I'm sorry, I should have came at this time. Uh, I'm going to fund this entire thing for you, j just as an apology. I, I feel like I need to. So I I'm donating $2 million to you. And just to get this taken care of, because this just isn't right. <sighs> I'm sorry. I I I'll get out of your hair now. Wait, what? He just fund enough money for a real surgeon, Patrick. We can, we can get SpongeBob a real doctor. Oh, let's get him there ASAP. A few. Man, I don't envy surgeons at all. That was stressful. All right, SpongeBob, you're back to your normal self now. Back to the world of the living. I'm surprised we could save you. But uh, there is one caveat. You're going to have to live with only one arm now. We looked everywhere for it. It's just completely gone. We did a whole sweep of the area. My arm? Wait, wh what? <laughs> at least it wasn't your Krabby Patty flipping arm or else I would have had to fire you. <laughs> you can still work like this. Maybe not as productive, but hey, you could get used to it. I wonder where that other arm went, though. Oh, I don't know if I'm ever going to be able to go jellyfishing with SpongeBob again now that he only has one arm. <gasps> A block of cheese! Oh, I bet I could eat it in one bite. Oh boy, oh boy. It's okay. I don't mind living with only one arm. As long as I can hold the Chaco Taco, everything is right in the world. All right, let's explore SpongeBob's brain now. What's through this door? Formula? <laughs>